This is Aaron Sorensen with FM Walleyes. Recently, a question came up at uh, our most recent FM Walleyes meeting about a tool that the Minnesota DNR has created called Lake Finder. So this is just a quick tutorial on that application. So go to any search engine and type in Lake Finder Minnesota and uh, several links will come up but just choose the first one and it'll bring you right to the Lake Finder tool. And you can type in your favorite lake, let's say Lida that's in Otter Tail County and when you click on get lake data it brings you the information that you're looking for. So you can click here on North Lida and it will bring you several different options. One of the things that uh, the question was about is uh, the most recent fisheries lake survey. So if you just click on the fisheries lake survey link, it will bring you to uh, all of the latest information about um, the lake survey. Down below is uh, the gillnet survey as well. Some really nice information that's uh, right on this tool. Another question that often comes up is about lake clarity. And you can see in this lake that uh, the lake clarity has been fluctuating over time, but uh, most recently has kind of gone back to its norm. Another really nice tool uh, associated with this is called the Recreation Compass. So if you're looking for lake information, not for just this lake, but maybe for some uh, other regional lakes, you can just click onto the recreational Recreation Compass link and it brings you out to a full view of uh, every lake that is in the state. And then you can just click on your lake, let's say it's Pelican, and again go to Lake Finder and it brings you into the same area except now this is uh, about um, Pelican Lake in Ottertail County. So I hope this gives you uh, some good information about how to get to Lake Finder and what the tools are within Lake Finder and uh, it's a tool I use frequently and I think you will too.